celebrate you. We're going to miss you. 30 years in that squad. Four different governors. Um, and you never compared which one. <laughs> <laughs> you are very good at that. So, um, I actually think I want I want uh, Governor Haslam and others to make comments. People that you. <laughs> One night, like we were here late for something, I thought I'm gonna try my hardest. Like she's been here, like so we talked about this. So this is kind of. How do you feel about us? And she goes, what do you mean? I said, like, us. Like, how do you feel? And she goes, you all eat a lot. I said, I know. She doesn't seem to have a lot of meals. So, <laughs> the other thing I want to see is when Vanessa moves out of here, like, literally, under her desk, like, anytime you ask her something, she'd reach under her desk and pull it out. It didn't matter what it was. Like, a <laughs> file, like a, a missing person. <laughs> like, everything was like magical place that was underneath <laughs> I can't wait to see when that gets cleaned out. <laughs> I just love the way you started, Governor, when you said like she can take all the incoming. It is it is brutal is a nice word. And I can remember we're in the middle of a couple of things and I thought, how can you take this? But I think it's your steady spirit and your gracious manner uh, that really made this fun for us in so many ways. And there's a whole bunch of people that worked with you and say like, but that's was just kind of our rock. She knew when we got here and didn't know what we were doing, she did. Uh, and then throughout it, she was just this peaceful, calm spirit that made the place different. So just know how grateful that I am and lots of, as the governor said, lots of other people could stand here and say the exact same thing. We, we really, really do appreciate you. Vanessa, we're excited about this next chapter. Not sure what in the world that's going to look like. <laughs> kind of feel sorry for your family. <laughs> but congratulations. Well deserved. Eight years ago when I was a freshman representative and had a flip phone, all I knew was 741 <laughs> And whether I was in Bristol or Nashville, I would call and she would say, Governor's office, Vanessa speaking, and I would say, can you connect me to the Department of Human Services? <laughs> and she would. And I could give you lots more examples. But you know, as I began to work full time in the Capitol, work with Betty, who was a friend of Vanessa's, the thing that stuck out to me is that Vanessa's entire time with us has been about connecting people, not just on the phone, but by connecting people through friendships and service. And uh, it's gonna be sad when there's not a governor's office, Vanessa speaking, <laughs> connecting people anymore. So I'll tell you a little funny story. Uh, my, my mother was trying to teach Vanessa Easter speech. And she said, Vanessa said, what are you looking at me so hard for? Vanessa said, what are you looking at me so hard for? My mother said, uh, I didn't come to stay, but nothing say you didn't. Vanessa's <laughs> 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 you know, always been laid back. She don't like surprises. So I'll, when I have something for her, I have to make it be a surprise because she doesn't want to be in the lab of life. But she's a very nice daughter, and she looks after me, and I'm just really proud of her. And uh, I was in this building once before, and I took a picture with Governor Haslam when they were giving Joey up. Some kind of award I don't know what it was. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just so proud of her. I'm very proud of her. I'm very proud of her. I'm very her. Ever since I've been here, she's led me and guide, guided me in every way that she could. As everyone else has said, she embodies class, okay, a humble spirit, servant. I'm the one that's just 
Sometimes I can get stirred up. <laughs> Tara Lee, now calm down. And I don't know who knows or who doesn't know, but she's just always been there for me, even with what I've been through in this last year. Checking up on me every day. So that's where she gets that Mama Nessa from. And I don't know what I'm going to do uh, when I'm up here from 6 to 2. Uh, and she's not coming through those doors and we have our little sit time and everything. So I'm gonna miss her, but I'm so happy for her. To God be the glory.